my biggest passion lies with children, adolescents, parents. Um, I think I feel that way because it is so rewarding um, to be able to change and impact a child for the rest of their life. Um, they come in here and if you can give them those skills and give parents those skills, how rewarding for them um, and how neat for them to grow up and maybe not struggle with some of those things um, that other adults do or other kids do that don't have the experience. I once worked with um, maybe like a six or seven year old little boy um, and he was just struggling emotionally. Um, he had never met his father. He um, had just a single mom and um, she was wonderful. Um, and I think for maybe several years, we struggled just emotional outbursts. Um, he had a really hard time understanding what was going on, but he, um, his ability as he grew um, and as he was in counseling um, and play therapy to be able to voice his frustrations um, was one of the neatest things I've ever seen. Um, it was truly everything you read as a, as a counselor in a textbook about play therapy. Um, he was on pay, he, he was exactly that. And it was just um, watching his transformation um, is something I will never forget. Um, and eventually being able to accept um, his mom finding someone um, and getting to have that relationship um, with a male figure in his life was really neat. He came into that room and felt like he was in a truly authentic relationship. There was no judgment. Um, he could be completely himself. Um, even if he was feeling emotionally volatile, I'm, I accepted everything, um, no matter what he brought. Um, and I think that made a huge impact on him and giving his mom those skills for at home as well and kind of showing her how I was able to do that um, also impacted him as well. And I always tell parents um, as we start working together, um, we're a team. You know, I always tell them, you're the expert on your child, even when it doesn't feel like it. Um, and I have all the counseling knowledge and together we're gonna figure it out. Meeting with parents when you're working with a child is one of the most important things you can do. Um, I tell them often that I get their child for maybe an hour a week or every other week. Um, and a lot of that work needs to happen outside of this room. And I want to give them the skills to make that happen at home. You were here at CC Fam for a long time. You left and you came back. I was almost to five years um, prior to, to um, taking a break to raise the children, just to be there for those tiny, tiny years. Of course, being a parent, um, especially with two, um, I now understand what it feels like um, to sit in that seat as a parent as well. Um, and the struggles that come with that um, and also the blessings. I was always um, so upbeat and, you know, you can fix it this way, this way, this way. You know, now I think that I would kind of, um, as a parent myself, go back and be real more a little more realistic and let's take this one thing and let's work on that um because I, it's challenging um to live daily life and work and um take care of kids and make sure all their needs are met i appreciate my parents <laughs> more than um i ever have in my life before um not only um how they chose to raise me and the support they provided um throughout my whole life um, but watching them now with my children, um, I'm kind of getting to see um, a new side to them too. Career-wise, um, it's important to me to keep um, learning more, keep training. Um, you know, I want my kids to see um, me helping other people. I think that's a huge thing for them to watch their mom get to do that.